Most of our schools have certified athletic trainers and they're godsends on days like today. Days like today are hot. And that's when Trinity High School's athletic trainer, BK Carboni, has to be cool, calm, and collected to make sure her student athletes are safe. I don't think anyone was expecting it to be this hot the first week of September, so lucky us. BK talks with coaches and athletic directors throughout the day to see if it's cool enough to practice or games to be played. It can be really dangerous, especially if our kids are not acclimated. That beeping is coming from a wet bulb globe temperature sensor, which measures the heat in multiple ways. The heat index on the field is above 86.2, then schools can't play. And whatever uh, number we're in between, with, uh, there's going to be certain restrictions that we have. So whether it be football can only practice for two hours today, or football can be helmets only. Concord High School canceled its opening cross country meet and rescheduled its soccer game today. Their principal sent out an email saying there will be no competitive contests. Practices are limited to 60 minutes with no strenuous activity. Every 15 minutes, there will be a 15 minute water break, preferably in the shade. And if an athlete asks to step out of practice, they're allowed to do so. You know, we say to them, look, you're not going to win a state championship by going hard on days like today. And just to be extra prepared, coaches have to take a heat-related illness class just in case one of their athletes overheats. And these athletic trainers, they're in constant communication with these athletes, make sure their body is prepared for either practice or the games. And they also have ways, if they do overheat, to cool them down with some ice water. We're live here in Manchester. Troy Lynch, WMUR News 9.